Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here, and welcome back to another Elden Ring build video. Today we are going to be focusing on Colossal Swords on a pure strength build. Since the recent patch changed the way Hyper Armor works, I want to see how many trades we can get with Colossals, how the damage I put on the trades is, and really just test the class overall since the recent patch. To that end, we have a nice variety of Ashes of War. We have Braggart's Roar, that way we can go for the R2s, get the high damage output on the trades, and see how the Hyper Armor is on that. I also have Storm Stomp for the guaranteed R1, really great on Colossal Swords. Storm Stomp got buffed as well, now it just poise breaks, unless someone is in Hyper Armor frames, they're going to get stunned by that. That's very powerful, especially when paired with the Colossal. I have Trolls Roar as well, since I'm going to be using the Roar buffs for the Braggart's Roar. May as well have an AoE. And of course, the Ruined Greatsword. Always an amazing L2 in tunnels in certain areas when they're aggressing you. Just overall a nice variety of Ashes of War. Another interesting change they brought to the Colossal Sword class was damage reduction while in Hyper Armor frames. So when you are attacking and you're in Hyper Armor, I believe the Colossal Sword class gets a 17.5% damage reduction. So you're going to be tanking hits a lot better. That's another good reason to go for Hyper Armor trades. You will probably win the damage trade since you are getting the higher damage reduction. I believe there's certain Ashes of War with it as well. I think Waves of Darkness was one to my memory, but I do have that on the Colossal Sword class as well. As for the Talismans, I'm going to be using the Roar Medallion since we're going to be using a few Roar attacks. I have the Shard of Alexander to boost all the different Ashes of War. I do need the Great Jars Arsenal. Some of these are very heavy, and then we're using the Bulgo Talisman. That really covers everything that I'd want to say. I just want to test out the Colossal Sword class as a whole. So let's just see how this performs in the invasions. Oh, the royal capital with green. I'm guessing that they're an enjoyer of green. Oh, Akaza, also an enjoyer of high latency. I don't know how much they enjoyed that though. Probably about as much as the host did. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, what do we want to do? We'll put the roar on. Kaza, you're not the host, right? I hope you're not. Well, there goes the sun, bro. I didn't even know you existed, to be honest. <laughs> That's funny. I'll be drinking my FP, though. Excuse me. Thank you. My FP has been drinking. Hello. Oak. Uh, a little confused why my thrust didn't hit him there. But, you know, it's okay. We will move on from that. Cannon? No? No cannon. Ooh, what do I want to do? Uh, you know what? My connection to this guy isn't the best. So we'll heal up. Frostbite him a little bit. There we go. The cause of your frostbitten. I'll get my lightning going. That is not lightning. This is lightning. I'll try and catch him in a storm stone, just because our connection is not nice. Goodbye, Akaza. We can probably hyper armor that with this, right? Man, storm stomp on a colossal. Very powerful. The fact that you get the connected R1 and the AR is already so high. Into the snowfield and catacombs we go with Morta. Hello, wizard. Retromancer and Morta. Ooh! You're trying to get me stuck in there. It's a little cold for my liking. Not a huge fan. <laughs> Dancing around this because that's true art. <laughs> Into R1. Almost a true combo. Well, it was a true combo, but almost one shot him, actually, is what I was trying to say. Wait, they're kind of in a situation where maybe Waves of Darkness could benefit from this? No. Okay, well, I'm going to dodge the cold. Wait. Yeah, I was going to say, shouldn't it fire? In the meantime, may as well get some regen going. Hello there, blue. Oh. 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 Interrun attack. Goodbye, blue. 
Hello there. I'm gonna heal. Your dead body knocked me. That's hilarious. Hey there. This is for you, wizard. More than the host. Woo! Oh boy, that does more damage than I thought. What the heck? I was taking a lot of damage in there. Interesting. That's something new for me. I didn't know that. What? Guess the lava's better than one thing. R2. Uh, I feel like that should have been a roll catch. And I feel like that shouldn't have hit me, but that's just me. Oh yes, they had to come over here, so the frost is gone. Ha 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 ha. And then I hit it. And they must deal. <laughs> Add a little regen. <laughs> kind of trying to bait them into that while I just buff up my swords here. Hey there, wizard. I've separated you from your pal. Kind of forced the 1v1 here. The other guy's trying so hard to get to you, Mr. Wizard. He truly is. Oh, he made it. Hey there. Now we hit this. <laughs> I have no idea what this guy is doing, but he's pondering tons of explosions. <laughs> Boing. Oh my god, that's gonna explode. <laughs> this has been the most chaotic invasion I've ever seen. Oh my god, it's great. <laughs> um, what great sword? You know what? It's a wizard with light roll, so it might be pretty beneficial for us to have. Oh, Storm Stomp to roll catch it. Hey there, wizard. <laughs> I didn't want that backstab attempt, to be honest. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, go. I'm gonna knock it back down. Yeah, there we go. Pretty sure it's aimed sideways right now, right? Thanos summoned. Oh, shit. It is aimed sideways right now. Pretty chaotic, Mr. Wizard. <laughs> Roll got to death. Oh, that one was actually kind of a fun one. I've had some great invasions here, but this one was hilarious. <laughs> so much anarchy. <laughs> Ooh, into the shunning grounds we go with Donovan. Donovan. Oh yeah, this area. Hello there. It looked like you were coming at me. Let's get our roar going here. Hello guys, how are you? Ooh, a big bonk stick. We backstabbed the big bonk stick. That might finish Maldovas off. Dodge the wizard. R2. Oh ho, rivers of blood, huh? We're gonna definitely handle that with some blood balls. Flying through the air. No, I definitely don't wanna be between the wizard and the katana guy. That's definitely the bad spot to be. Let's frostbite the katana. Well, I guess the wizard. Sorry. That slightly missed, I guess. I don't know what's coming my way, but it sounds like wizardry. We heal the bleed again. We have to frostbite the katana. Oh, high latency with Mr. Katana Man. All right, you know what? We'll switch Ash of Wars then. <laughs> Do this again. I'm gonna try and guess where he's gonna go. Okay, he's dodging well. Maybe this will help catch him. We get an R1 off a of Storm Stomp, so. <laughs> you would jump into it. That's funny. Oh, well, there goes the host. R2. Yeah, it takes a while for the confirmation to actually stun him. <laughs> Definitely worth, though. Goodbye, Anastasia. Fun fight, guys. Cave of the Forlorn with Tioga. Alright, Tioga. 
This might prove to be interesting. Hi there, guys. I have a... What is happening? Someone in the wall. I swear. Wait, what? Oh my god, invisible phantom. Someone in the wall? Nope. Just an invisible guy, that's all. I'm just kind of aiming at wild here. <laughs> well, I killed the phantom? I can't even hit the invisible phantom. I Sorry, I killed the player. What is happening? <laughs> I'm fighting ghosts. <laughs> Get me out of here. We've invaded Bruxo Loco. Right by the bonfire. Well, you know, it, it is a grace, but it's essentially a bonfire. Ooh, they got a teammate. They've got two teammates. Hello there, Bruxo. Oh, lightning. Yeah, that true combos. <laughs> and I've sort of been forgetting until this moment. <laughs> oh man, that makes it a lot stronger when I think about it. <laughs> the shunning grounds, but I'm behind the gate that they haven't opened. Um, you know, we may just use the bloody finger. This is much better. I think they're actually in the grace room. Most likely, anyway. Yeah, they're summoning. Perfect. What do we got here? A wizard. Hello, wizard. How are you? You're an enjoyer of the R2 of the Moonlight Great Sword. Alright, you just gotta stay alive until your teammate gets here. That's the game we must play. He's gonna do it. <laughs> he survived! Good job. Okay, now we uh, pop your bubble tier. Uh, now we pop your tier. Uh, excuse me. Pop. Pop. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> well, since we're in a nice, small room, guys. Here, this is for you. There goes one of them. There goes the summon. <laughs> okay, we got rid of one. Now we can go back to our roaring ways. Oh, oh god, that came out before he actually attacked. Perfect. Okay. Gotta watch out for the skipped animations. We roar. And you know, just to be safe, we'll get a little bit of magic defense boost. Hi there. Whoa. Perfect. A match with the real Goku. Quite literally. Doesn't matter, because this Goku didn't level HP. Goodbye, Mr. Wizard. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Max Max. No idea that I have iframes, apparently. <laughs> Hyper armor. Just trade right into the Colossal Sword. That's a good idea. <laughs> I love hosts so much sometimes. It's a moon veiler in their natural habitat. Into the deep root depths we go. <laughs> and I was just in time to see a sun bro fall. Well, hello there, Baba Chris. How are you? You see me? Good jump, good jump. This shall be our battleground, Barba. Are you ready? Use your explosion wave at me. I know you want to. My R2. Into my other R2. <laughs> well, Barba, this is at least an interesting battleground. It is unfortunate that your phantom fell off the tree. Gravity is a rough death. And the compass got smaller, so they're right here. Hi, guys. How are you? I think you're going to be aggressive. I like that. That's for you. Uh, none of that hit Chris. A little confused as to how, but that's okay. Maybe Chris was having some interesting packet loss. No, Chris cannot be damaged by me. That is terrible. Oh my god. Chris. But Chris has perfect connection to me. Alright, so we can't trade into Chris at all. So we're gonna... Oh, that's my dagger from earlier. So, there, my hit might hit it now, yeah. While the packets are getting received, we smack them. That's the plan. 
<laughs> well, I don't know what's going on, but sometimes I get the worst connections. Oh, there it is. There's my hit. Um, let's see. I'm probably gonna have to trade with them, but maybe we could try to backstab Chris. I might get pulled back into that. Quite honestly, hey, there's my hit. <laughs> Okay, we'll just do this. We'll stay as far away from Chris as we can. That might hit Chris, no? Did not hit Chris. That will, though. We need to get rid of Chris. There we go. <laughs> you need to go away, Chris. <laughs> You are far too powerful, just face tanking and then taking damage 10 seconds later. Okay. I haven't really tested the connection with Lord, but we'll see. Perfect. <laughs> Goodbye, Lord. Interesting invasion, to say the least. Oh my god, a hero's grave with Weber. Hmm. Oh boy. Oh boy. No! Ow, oh, hello, Weber. How are you? We'll be just doing this, swinging some hyper armor in your general direction, Weber. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you did it to me first. I was gonna come up and say hello. But you attacked me and wanted me to die to the chariot. Alright, those are all the invasions that I have for you guys for today with the Colossal Swords. I hope everyone enjoyed this showcase. Once again, there's my stats on the right, the armor that I wore, the talismans that I mostly used, and of course all the different Colossals that I used as well. I had a great time trying out all the different Ashes of War on them as well. Always feel free to recommend other changes that have been made since the recent patch, and I'll get to trying them out as soon as I can. I'm going to try out every weapon class, see how they feel. So I do appreciate all the input you guys give. Until the next video, this is goodbye. I will see you all next time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.